Welcome back to HodgePodge. This video will be a very quick explanation of exercise 18 in the level 1 Rhino training manual, where we are taught how to use smart tracking. Get started by opening up the constraints.3dm file that you should have downloaded with the level 1 Rhino training manual. To turn on your smart tracking option, check the smart tracking option in the object snaps menu on the bottom left like so. Now go to the top menu and select Curve, Point Object, Single Point, or by selecting the Single Point tool icon on the left. By hovering over the end point of the top green rectangle, the Smart Tracker will detect that end point. We will know that it has done so when a temporary white tracking point appears. If we travel south, you will notice our point has set up a guideline for us that our next point will automatically snap to. We can then add another tracking point by hovering over the end point of the yellow rectangle on the right. After doing so, we are left with another smart tracking point that also provides us with a white guide. With using our smart tracking feature, we can now find the point at which these rectangles would intersect if they extended out farther. Doing this without our smart tracking feature would be virtually impossible. Click to place your point. As always, thanks for watching. Please feel free to leave a like, share this video, check out my other videos, and subscribe.